This is Bocadasse, a fishing village on the outskirts of Geneva. It is popular with everyone at the weekends. Fishermen here always have to have a cat. And Pasta Granny Bianca is friends and neighbours with this one, who looks just like the menacing Machiavelli in Pixar's animation Luca, a tale of friendship and summer in the Cinque Terre. Bianca is making pesto lasagna for us. Buongiorno, sono Bianca di Bocadasse, Genova, e oggi preparerò le lasagne al pesto al forno con fagiolini e patate. Innanzitutto faccio la pasta. To make the dough, she uses 300 grams of zero zero flour and three eggs. Ora impasto. Ma questa va bene perché poi la lavoro con la macchinetta. Ah, va bene. Sì, 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 ecco, basta. Ora la She gives it a good knead and then leaves it to rest, covered for 30 minutes. Next, Bianca makes the basil pesto. Questa è di Prato, che è la zona migliore per il pesto. Vengano, invece quelli un po' più grossi si chiamano bouquet. In Liguria, one buys Genovese basil plants wrapped in paper like this. It keeps the leaves fresher for longer. Proprio odore di Genova. Bianca picks off the leaves from four bunches and rinses them off. Pietro! Her grandsons Pietro and Leonardo are back from school and hungry. No, volevo soltanto guardarla perché oggi non siamo andati a scuola per guardarla. Se vuoi andare là sulla scala, posso mangiare? Aspetta, allora posso scuola. Sono i miei bambini, che è tanto che non li posso abbracciare in questo periodo. Ah, che brutto. Bianca has a good way to dry the basil leaves. She places them between two tea towels, rolls them up and twists them tightly. Così, viene bello, si asciuga e non, le foglie rimangono tali quali. Guardate. She removes the sprout or anima from three cloves of aromatic garlic from Vesalico. Bianca blitzes these with the basil, two tablespoons of Italian pine nuts, seven tablespoons of parmigiano, and one tablespoon of pecorino sardo. Because if you want to make a good pesto, you need to put the roba buona. She adds around 100 ml of mild Ligurian extra virgin olive oil. The result is a thick but not too smooth puree. If you blitz it too much, it changes the flavor of the basil. diventare un po' più morbido per, per, per condi, poter condire ecco perché deve condire ecco. Bianca places it in the fridge while she makes the lasagna sheets her electric pasta attachment makes easy work of the process She trims the pasta into oblongs. Placing the pieces on a tablecloth helps them dry a little. The next step is to make the bechamel sauce. Bianca uses 70 grams of butter and 70 grams of flour to make a roux. Then she gradually mixes in 500 ml of milk. Vedi 
Bianca peels and slices a large potato and trims a handful of green beans. These will be boiled until tender. Bianca blanches her lasagna in simmering salted water for a couple of minutes. She uses a tablespoon of pasta water to make her pesto more of a cream. Anche quando si fanno le altre lasagne crude, si aggiunge sempre un pochino d'acqua di cottura per riuscire a renderla un po' più così, deve diventare una crema. She plunges the pasta into very cold water to stop it cooking, then dries it between several tea towels. Layered like this, the lasagna is ready to assemble. Bianca starts with a mixture of bechamel sauce and pesto mixed together in the baking dish. She adds a layer of pasta and repeats the process. She wants five layers minimum. Then she scoops out the vegetables which have been simmering in the pasta water. She mixes them with the pesto and the bechamel and makes a final layer with them. She scatters plenty of parmesan over everything and bakes the lasagna in a moderate oven for 40 minutes. Leftover pesto scooped up with focaccia is the boys' treat while they wait. They're very lucky to have a lasagna making grandmother like Bianca. Grazie. La lasagna è pronta. Buon appetito. Buon appetito. Perfetto. Have you seen Luca yet? Pixar asked our pasta grannies to watch the trailer. Spot Bianca. She loved it. Yeah! <laughs> that was hard to watch. <laughs> we do not go anywhere near the surface. Ooh. Ah, è un pesciolino che si trasforma in un bambino. Ah. The sky, clouds, the sun. <laughs> Don't look at it. Just kidding. Che manata negli occhi. Mio nipote è uguale. I'm kind of an expert. Mom. Eh, fantastico. Oh, qui in Vespa. La Vespa uguale a mia figlia, rossa. Hey, leave them alone. Go start the club. For losers. <laughs> Come simpatico! Che bello! What's under the dogs? Bello, bellissimo, guarda! What do you think he Oh mamma! Come mi piace! Your life is so much cooler than mine! There's a million things you think you can't do! Wow! Che bello! Bello, bellissima, bravi. Something's fishy with you two. Oh, oh le cinque terre, ho visto i terrazzamenti delle cinque terre. Oh. I know your problem. You got a Bruno in your head. A Bruno. Ah. Say, she lets you Bruno. Ha capito Bruno. Bruno. Can you still hear him? Nope, just you. Good. <laughs> <laughs> You do it now. Just say the thing. What's wrong with you, stupido? Oh, yeah. Madonna. Che bello. Bellissimo. Yeah.